Hey everyone, my name is Sabs and I'm from Khabarone, Botswana. I'm here to present to you Bot Stu. I'm currently doing a degree at the University of Melbourne in Bachelor of Medicine and Surgery. Welcome to the first episode of Bot Stu. Bot Stu will be focusing on the land down under, Australia. In the next few weeks, we'll be looking at Melbourne, the tourist capital of Australia. There are over 100 Botswana students studying in Australia at the moment in various universities, such as the University of Melbourne, Deakin University, Swinburne, Monash, Victoria, La Trobe and RMIT. So step back and relax as we take you into the inside of students studying abroad. stands for Botswana students studying around the world. It's a TV documentary that focuses on the lifestyles of students around the world. It shows daily routines and activities of students at their respective homes. This includes cleaning, cooking, studying, watching TV and just hanging out with their friends. Students abroad are involved in a lot of activities such as cultural nights, independence celebrations and sports activities. Bots do follow the students to each of these events. It follows students at their various universities, at the libraries, the labs and lectures. We also have a look at students during their leisure times at shopping malls, cinemas, clubs and various activities that students get up to abroad. Botsdu will also give you the chance back home to see the various aspects of cities that your students live in. For example, we look at the beaches, the museums, the tourist attractions available to each of the students living in different parts of the world. It encourages, develops and promotes intellectual and multicultural relationships between Botswana students and other races around the world. It creates a sense of belonging, pride and loyalty of Botswana students studying abroad to their own country. This program serves as a source of inspiration and motivation to other students. It's a bit different from home and you got your ups and downs and all that but if you weigh it up and down you got the pros and the cons of living out here and the pros and cons of living back at home. But the government is helping us out. The stipend is I feel the stipend is it's enough to get us through. Hey Robin Motatans, you know. People are struggling every day. We're not worrying about the people who are always studying, you know, who are always doing that way. Let's get us a little bit this we get, you know, and Coming here, a lot of us are homesick and you know. <laughs> you can Okay, now, do you want to come inside? <laughs> This is my house. Uh, I live here with two of my boys, Vinikas and Logic. It's very affordable to uh, rent a house rather than living in uni because it's very cheaper and we, the government giving us a lot of money, not a lot, but enough money to pay for the house. And I'm doing uh, medicine, I'm a third year medical student in Monash University, so I thought maybe doing medicine would give me the chance to, you know, to help people out there to improve the health in my country. We also have Pali tea, so it's not like Ratsaba Juta Batswana. So if you know, so the government bringing students to Monash University or overseas to Australia is a good thing. But I would say it would be better if our own country had such facilities or such things. So, yeah.
a fel mint Siva, de te ki tartom, mint Siva. Szent igaz, hogy mi a lorgyengák. Harca harácháj, rájmel lehelom a melencím. Michael Lokovaré recena, ám egy rékopadi tíró. Kávon tenkát 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 Um, doing medicine was really hard at times but fun as well so I can't, I can't complain at this moment because I've finished And I'll come break into your house again I know you love it when I show you that I really Center where various groups perform, including the African Footprints, and hopefully we'll see some talent from Botswana showing up here pretty soon. Melbourne has a variety of museums, art centers, and a whole lot of grand old buildings, fantastic dining, and art centers. UK, United States, South Africa, and even new students in Botswana, we're coming next to you. 